So we were just about to leave and go up to Mosul for Christmas. We heard on the radio, Nullakai's engine did not start. It burns. <laughs> oh my god, you guys! Are you okay? Subscribe to join us and our travels as we share our life on the sea. Living on a boat, you drop your anchor quite a lot. When we drop our anchor, the chain goes into the water and it's super helpful to know how much chain you let out. Over the years aboard Catalpa, we've tried many ways to keep count of the chain as it goes out. We've tried these plastic chain things, zip ties, and even painting sections of the chain. All these things are okay short term, but never seem to last that long. We saw this idea online and thought it might be a better solution. So today, Bella is sewing on these tabs every 10 meters so we can see how much chain we let out without guessing. So yesterday I um, sewed numbers onto the blue tags and today we're gonna sew them onto the chain. the last one yes well we'll see how that goes but I'm sure it will last longer than a zip tie and better for the environment too so we were just about to leave and go up to Mosul for Christmas and we heard on the radio that Nullakai's engine did not start so we no, 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 turned no, no, around no, no, and side no, no, tied no. again we're completely <laughs> and fucked, that's completely fucked. <laughs> so now we don't know if we're going to be sitting in Ambon for Christmas or what we're going to be doing. Anyway, Matt is in the engine bay and uh, we're going to go over and play this lovely little song for him. He's going to he's going to love it. I'm going to film him. So yeah, you're welcome. Who, who would own one? <laughs> hey. So yeah, we're side tied back in Ambon. It's uh, four days till Christmas. We're hoping to be up in Masul for Christmas, but. Here we are. Weather conditions were beautiful today, guys. Had lots of wind. We had a five minute sail and had to turn around. It literally rained for the time that we were sailing. It did. did. We pulled an anchor. We pulled an anchor. It started raining. <laughs> anyway, and Alakai, they said, you guys go. And we said, no, no, we're not leaving you for Christmas. So here we are. Let's go see what Matt's up to. He's not in there. <laughs> he's, uh, he's ran away. Hi, my name's Liam. <laughs> we are provisioned up to go, but we are still in Ambon. <laughs> Look at those eggplants. Next door is busy in their engine bay, and we are Bella and Liam. The kids are going to make gingerbread biscuits. Here she is, the star of the show. It's time to make some gingerbread cookies with Bubba! Woo! Do we have brown sugar? Cooking with Booza. Oh, cooking with the Booza!
bigger mirror. Just How's so it going? See, what, see what's going on, or is a bigger one better? Are you helping? Have you been a good boy? Yeah, I have. I've been amazing. Are you a star? Yeah. <laughs> Matt, I reckon you're a star. And here, you deserve a star. Does that work for you? Shooting <laughs> star. Was this what you wished for the other day when you saw a shooting star? Because you need to get better wishes. Oh, is that what you wished for a new engine? Jeez! Oh, oh, no. that, was a, that was not the right way to get it. Well, the universe is just going, uh, all right, stuff this engine oh, up, you'll get a new one. Like, you can fit two people in your engine bay. Oh, no. Look oh my that. god. It's got all the I can fit in, in there. I'm coming in too. I'm coming in. <laughs> um, so I should say T1, and there should be a line. Lee would kill for an engine room like this, Matt. Just remember that. I guess. <laughs> yeah, well, no. Matt will give it to him in about 10 minutes. <laughs> He'll be sick of it in, about, in a couple of minutes. Is that tight? Uh, that's pretty good. I'll don't tighten that right up until you use the other end. You know what's great about your boat is you can you have all this stuff, but it's out here, it's away. Mm. Meanwhile the kids continue making Christmas cookies. We've come over to shore today and um, we're going to see if we can get a ride to the beach and to the hot springs and go check it out. We've been in Ammon for a little while now and we thought we'd go do something fun and something nice. So it's Christmas Eve Eve and yeah we're just going to go have the afternoon in the hot springs or maybe even at the beach. The lovely owner over here is allowing us to use his car so that's super sweet. Lee's gonna drive and we're all gonna pile in. We're going to the water hot springs. The water hot springs. The water hot springs. So I'm going in the front. You know you're not in the front, you gotta get in the you back. You always have to do in the back. <laughs> yeah. All right. Okay? Yeah. <laughs> you guys pile in the back, all the kids in the back. <laughs> do you want me to sit there? We got this. The run comfy? So Epan has given us his car and his sister is going to come with us as our tour guide. It wasn't the best win to be at the beach. It was a bit rough, but we still went in for a swim. Was that fun, Sarah? <laughs> It was like, <laughs> Taz, did you enjoy that swim with the nappy? Yeah. Nah. Well, I'm going to enjoy the hot spring. <laughs> We're at the hot spring at Abanal. No, in this one at that end it's hotter. This one. In that end. Is it hard? Bella, how are you doing 
<laughs> well, it's the toughest. All right, I'm going. Oh, I feel it. I feel like belly popping. Oh, this one. This one, yes, we can handle it. Oh, oh, the sunburn hurts. Oh, 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 it's so hot. I then you can't get to the end, though. I can't see when it ends. I feel like I'm going to end. It's you get a massage. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Okay, you can get the service. It gets hotter as you go along. He's trying to cool the water in front of him. Oh, it's, you're bringing up the cooler water. Get away from me. Who's going to crack it first? Lee's hoping that you <laughs> What are you doing? Sarah, you're doing well. I'm winning. Just be careful. <laughs> yeah. Good job. You go crazy. Okay. Crazy. okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, they're going winning. See the rules. Oh, just go a little bit further in front of him, Sarah. Oh, you can do it. Ooh. Yes, yes! I win! Yes! Oh, no. Yes! Win my nose! Yes! No, Sarah's got you! Yes! <gasps> Look at you! Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Ambon has a big Christian population, which means Christmas is celebrated here. And there is plenty of lights and Christmas decorations in the streets. Well, it's Christmas Day and we spent it with our Aussie mates on board an alakai, eating, drinking and swapping and gifts. And I want it all from the lights to the mistletoe. Tell me one thing, is there anything that you're missing? I will keep you warm as soon as you remove that snow. Merry Christmas! This next bit was particularly stupid, and kids don't do this at home. Lee and Liam thought it would be a great idea to take Nalakai's dinghy and put on a fireworks show from the dinghy in the middle of the bay. <laughs> what 
was that, Matt? Was that <laughs> all the fireworks? <laughs> that was it. No, I think they're scared. That was ridiculous. That was not safe. Oh my god. That that's the biggest adrenaline rush I'll ever have. That was awful. There's what? not enough sand. There's not enough sand in the bucket. It just rolled over. Oh yeah, no shit. The whole is freaking scary. Was that your big one? Oh. That was the big one. Oh Did my god. On I told you to go find the water. It scared. went boof. And then, and then I could just see it again, and it was pointing at us. I won't leave. <laughs> oh shit! Gotta... And then one flew out that way, and I was like, "Oh no, I can't see where it is. I'm trying to get me light on so I could flick it, but I couldn't see." Did it land? Oh, it man, went that into the, the boat. Look at it. Look at. It. Oh, we're gonna watch that. Whoa. Oh my god! Oh. Wait, shine that light, Tara. I can't oh, my pants. <laughs> that was not the smartest thing oh ever. No, it was, I we like the box got more one. Dirt. Like that's it's it lucky only just enough to balance it. Lee, like lucky you didn't ignite those ones. Oh, we, I would have jumped over. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I was expecting to see you jump in the water. That's I was just about cool. to. That would be quite funny if I did jump in the water. <laughs> <laughs> you didn't know where to go. Can I have the box one? No, don't do more. Oh, the box one's alright. But what? That, the tall one I do, because when we put it in, it's like wobbly. <laughs> but then the first boof, <laughs> and then I, I look down, and it's like pointing at us. I was like, oh no! <laughs> I cracked my pants when they said, run! <laughs> Where are you going to run to? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, they're out there again. They're going, they're going for round two, just because I, I don't really know why. Oh my god. Oh my god. Get down! Oh my god! You're so close! Oh! Oh, wow! Oh, wow! That would be good one. was so scary that first one. <laughs> no, that, was like... the last one was the scariest because I saw it and I, I saw it and didn't go. I was like, oh. oh. We're expecting to see he's come back all black. <laughs> black. <laughs> all you gotta do is stick that one at the bottle. They're called bottle rockets. I, I know. I, when yeah, we were when just worried Jimmy. about at the back there where the throws a flame out near the tank. That was all. How did you did you wedge it in there? The anchor. He put it in. Yeah, it was sort of just sitting at the front of it, but it was still wasn't. It was locked in too tight. Yeah, I think it third degree burns from the spikes. Well, you're lucky you still got your face, mate. What are you talking oh, I about? I my face. That was the first thing I did. Third degree's pretty bad. Oh, I thought it was game over. I was, I, was, I was nearly, when I seen it didn't go, I was like, did we bail out or we didn't have time? It was just like... Yeah, well, <laughs> didn't have time? Or are you just going to just sit in there and right, burn? Lee, Lee said, um... Jump out, man. Lee said with the fizz eight, I'm, I'm getting ready to jump out. And he started moving back and he got to this back step and he's like, I'm jumping! <laughs> and it, it started... Yeah. Like, I was trying to put the torch on and I was panicking, I couldn't get it on. I thought, okay, just grab it and throw it in the water, it'll be... It'll be well, that could have been a lot worse. We ended the night with some karaoke, but I'll spare you that footage. Thanks so much for watching and we'll see you next time. Bye!